in this video let us see how the refrigerants are designated with the symbols of R1121, R1, 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 R1 like that. So let us see first the classification of refrigerants. So refrigerants are classified like this. First halocarbons. Halocarbons. And hydrocarbons. In hydrocarbons there are saturated and unsaturated. And next uh, there is inorganic compounds. and azeotropes in this video let us see just the designation and uh, we will not go deep into the what are these halocarbons hydrocarbons and those just uh, we restrict ourselves to designation only so here halocarbons and saturated carbons are designated using same principle and uh, unsaturated are designated using another principle inorganic compounds are designated using another principle so first let us see how are halocarbons and saturated compounds designated so here there is a formula for this let me take another color R m minus 1 n plus 1 p so this is how we designate for halocarbons and saturated hydrocarbons so what is here m n and p they are c m h n f p c l q so here c c means carbon h is hydrogen f is fluorine and the Cl means chlorine. So, if carbon has n number of atoms, H uh, hydrogen is having n, fluorine is having p, and chlorine is having q. So, this is how we represent it. And he here there are n, n, and p. So, what about q? There is a relation between all this. n plus p plus q is equal to 2n plus 2. So let us see with an example. So here let us take a saturated hydrocarbon, methane. Let us take methane example. Methane which is CH4. So here carbon is, so here M is equal to 1, carbon has 1 and hydrogen this is carbons and what is hydrogen it is n which is equal to 4 so what is the designation of methane it is r m minus 1 so 1 minus 1 it is 0 n plus 1 4 plus 1 and p what is p here p is equal to 0 why because there is no fluorine atom so it is 0. So what will be the designation? 1 minus 1 is 0 and 4 plus 1 is 5 and next 0. R50 is the designation of methane. This is the saturated hydrocarbon. Next let us see halocarbon. Example of halocarbon. CH Cl2 F this is this is dichloro dichloro two atoms of chlorine monofluoro methane so this is an example of halocarbon so here what is n number of carbon atoms n so here it is 1 so m is equal to 1 
annexed n so what is n number of hydrogens so n is equal to 1 and next to p what is p here p is equal to what is p it is of fluorine right fluorine fluorine is 1 and q of chlorine this is of fluorine for chlorine it is 2 so what is the designation r m minus 1 n plus 1 and p so we can write r m minus 1 1 minus 1 n plus 1 1 plus 1 and p 1 so we can write it as r 21 and next let us see what is the designation for unsaturated hydrocarbons for unsaturated hydrocarbons it is r 1 m minus 1 n plus 1 p and n plus p plus q is equal to 2 m this is similar to saturated carbon, carbon uh, hydrocarbons but there is one extra here and there is no addition of 2 here so let us take an example for this too let us take ethylene for what is the formula for ethylene C2H4 C2H4 is ethylene so here carbon M is equal to 2 and hydrogen N this is for hydrogen N is equal to 4 so what is P here P is equal to 0 and what is the formula for ethylene R 1 M minus 1 2 minus 1 N plus 1 4 plus 1 and what is P 0 so R 1 1 5 0 is the designation of ethylene and what is the formula for inorganic compounds it is R 700 plus molecular weight so let us see an example ammonia so what is the chemical formula of ammonia it is NH3 so what is molecular weight molecular weight of NH3 is nitrogen it is atomic weight as 14 and next hydrogen hydrogen atomic weight is 3 so it will be 17 so ammonia can be represented as R 700 plus 17 so R 717 is the designation of ammonia